hello students welcome again to your ds class students today i will start a new chapter that is chapter 15 okay and the name of this chapter is travel around okay travel around now let's start we go from one place to another place to work or to meet our relatives and friends who live far away okay we go from one place to another okay one place to another place to work or to meet our relatives friends okay who live far away clear for this we need different means of transport yes for this we need different means of transport they help us to reach places faster okay with the help of the transports we can travel easily okay there are three types of transports okay three types of transport first land transport second water transport and the third is air transport clear so we go from one place to another place to work or to meet our relatives and friends who live far away for this we need different means of transport they help us to reach places faster there are three types of transport okay there are three types of transport first one is land transport second one is water transport and third one is air transport okay first land transport land transport means of land transport are used on land yes means of land transport are used on land they include cars bicycles buses scooters okay trains etc there are many vehicles that move on the land on the road people use tow block cart car bus bicycle etc to travel on the road clear so land transport means the means of land transport are used on land they include cars bicycle buses scooters trains etc on the road people use tow block cart car okay bus bicycle etc to travel on the road clear next on the track on the track trains metro metro trains and trams move on the rails they are called the railways okay these are all the land transport okay but they move on the rails okay trains metro trains and trams move on the rails they are called railways okay look at this trains metro train train okay tram next water transport means of water transport move on water yes water transport move on water they include ships boats steamers and the yachts look at this these are ship boat steamer okay water transport move on water okay next air transport means of air transport fly in the air yes the air transport fly in the air they include aeroplanes helicopters rockets okay means of air transport help us to cover long distance in a very short time they move very fast okay so means of air transport fly in the air they include aeroplanes helicopters and the rockets means of air transport help us to cover long distance in a very short time okay they move 
very fast aeroplane is the fastest means of transport yes look at this these are the air transport aeroplane helicopter rocket okay these are the water transport sea boat steamer okay they move on water and they fly in the air and look at these these are the few example of land transport that move on the land clear so students you will read this chapter okay you will read this chapter first again i am repeating this now we go from one place to another place to work or to meet our relatives and the friends who live far away for this we need different means of transport they help us to reach places faster okay there are three types of transport land transport water transport and the air transport land transport are used on land okay these are the example of land transport car bus bicycle tonga okay next on the track trains metro trains trams move on the rails they are called the railways okay these are move on the railway tracks water transport means of water transport move on water they include ships boats steamers and yachts these are the example of water transport next air transport means of air transport fly in the air yes air transport fly in the air and these are the example of air transport aeroplane helicopter rocket okay means of air transport help us to cover long distance in a very short time they move very fast clear so students your homework is you will read this chapter properly at home okay clear what i am saying you will you will just read this chapter this is very easy chapter so uh, first you will read and in my next video i will start the exercise of this chapter but first you will read okay So that's it for today's class. Thank you.